Hello, welcome to this video. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to create this graph from your SNMP data from your networking devices. In this example, I'm using a Meraki MX65. I went ahead and created an SNMP, enabled SNMP, and also uh, grabbed my SNMP community public code. And then after that, I went to my data collector, which is where I would start here. So I'll just go ahead and sign in. In your data collector, the first thing you want to do is install net SNMP utils. Go ahead and look, look it up, but you want to make sure that you install SNMP and all the utilities that are necessary. As you can see here, I can just do an enter. I already have it installed. Then after that, you want to test connection to your SNMP device by running this command. So once you run that command with your own public uh, string, you should be able to get some information that you are connecting to your SNMP device. In this case, I'm connecting to Meraki, and I'm getting actually I'm getting data right here. I'm getting data from every interface. As you will see, once I get that data, you want to come to Grafana, do a create a dashboard, a graph, then you can go ahead and edit. Once you do that, you want to choose uh, right here we're using InfluxDB. Then from InfluxDB, we want to select SNMP where say let's just say uh, host equals uh, let's say agent host equals to my Meraki device the value should be if octets in as you can see I'm getting data this is my input so what would you end up looking like is this after you spend some time on it you will realize that uh, to get data that makes sense you want to choose this field if octets in you want the average derivative I'll choose just one and you want to apply by eight because uh, you want uh, bytes as you can see so and the alias I created in, so it can show up here as SNMP in. Then I'm also choosing the outbound. If octets out, and I'm choosing the mean, same derivative, negative 8, so I can see my out throughput right here. And after everything is done, I also, on the axis, you can just choose unit is bits per second. That's what you want to choose. You can show that. Then on the legend, I'm just showing the average le legend. You can choose your own. Then right here, I just want a line and the time range, I left everything the same way. And this is where we would come to create alerts when it is time to create alerts. So as you can see, this is a very brief overview of how this is done. It's very simple, it's very straightforward. All you need to do is enable SNMP on your de device on your uh, data collector, make sure that you also install SNMP. After you do that, you should just be able to go to your Grafana and get your data that looks exactly like this. So that's it for SNMP. If you have questions, let me know in the comments. Otherwise, we'll move on to the next one where I'll show you how to get data from iDRAC.